officers will now patrol several high schools in Santa Rosa leading up to winter break. Safety has become a big issue. It is now the topic of a school board meeting happening tonight. Sean Chitness is at Montgomery High School where a student was stabbed earlier this year. Some parents here at Montgomery High School are relieved that school resource officers are back in the district. They tell us that they are also glad that the school board will be taking up the issue tonight at their meeting. The superintendent decided to bring back school resource officers because of increased violence in the district. The number of incidents have spiked over the past several weeks. That includes a student at Santa Rosa High School stabbed by a classmate and a student here at Montgomery High arrested for bringing a knife to campus. All of that in addition to the death of a student who was stabbed after he was accused of attacking another student inside a classroom back in March. Santa Rosa City Schools says it has made a number of changes since March, but also points out there are challenges, including filling certain staff positions and funding constraints while dealing with a rise in gang violence. We need to have a police on campus. I say, you know, like many schools in Oakland and other places, you know, they put, you know, the, the little door when it's just like the, you know, the detector or something like that. And say, you know, it's like that, you know, it's working for another school, so even, you know, in the worst place. It has to be working. Little by little, you know, we need to make the change. The school resource officer or SRO program was in place from 1997 to 2020. For now, the SROs will be at all of the high schools and some middle schools until winter break. Santa Rosa City Schools says it actually had a drop in all disciplinary issues between last year and this year, which includes incidents that are not considered to be violent. The superintendent says she wants to hear other ideas and solutions from the school board tonight at their meeting. But not everyone is in favor of this move. Those that oppose the return of SROs will be wearing black tonight at the school board meeting. And a judge dismissed a manslaughter charge last month against the student accused of the fatal stabbing in March. The judge ruled that the student who was killed was the aggressor, but the 16-year-old still faces up to four years in prison on weapons charges.